Do you want some free FIFA points? Yeah, I know you do. I'm giving away 4,600 FIFA points. All you have to do to be in with a chance of winning is like this video, comment down below and subscribe if you're new. If you want some FIFA 20 coins, make sure to go to the link in the description and check out Mule Factory. They've got a 24-7 service, they're completely reliable, and make sure to use the code LE5CHEAP at checkout to get yourself a discount. Make sure to go and check them out. Oh, what is going on guys? LA96 and welcome back to a brand new video on my channel. In this video, we are back with another video which is going to be not a trading to 100k episode because I thought, you know what, I just want to take a break from it. I've been absolutely smashing it out, so I thought, you know what, I want to just do a video on how to make some easy coins in FIFA 20. If you enjoy this video, like target on this is going to be 200 likes. Go on, drop a like right now. If we manage to smash that, I'll get out some more videos on how to make easy coins, maybe some glitches as well. If you want to see a free coins glitch, that could be coming. But either way, you guys just... Drop a like on this video and comment down below what you want to see. But guys, for this video, what we are going to be doing is jumping over to squad battles. Now, please, please, please ignore my record at the top. Basically, this actually used to work within FIFA 19 and obviously they've not patched it in FIFA 20. So you can still actually do this in FIFA 20. So first things first, go over to squad battles. Now, what I want to show you guys really, really quickly is actually the different ranks and what you do actually get at these lower tiers right here within squad battles. As you can see right here, a lot of these ranks do actually get you different packs. As you can see right here, two premium gold packs, one gold pack, 4,000 coins just for silver two which is actually pretty decent but it goes as high as up to elite one which will actually get you two rare mega packs and 30,000 coins now i'm going to show you guys how to get elite one without even being any good at squad battles so this is going to be the easiest packs and coins that you're ever going to make it's going to take you quite a while however you could go through and do trading as well as it's completely up to you but personally for me say i'm doing something on my pc and i just want to have something running in the background still be making coins this is pretty much passive coins and passive packs which is pretty decent in my book so what i want you guys to go through and do is jump over to these squad battles and jump over to any of the featured squads or you can go for any of these opponents right here now with the squad battles opponents for the week you will be getting 40 opponents now each individual one of these if you use this method will actually give you 600 points within squad battles in addition to that as well you do actually have two of the featured squad battles which will be giving you around 1500 so what you guys need to go and do is jump over to squad battles and set it to beginner now i know a lot of you guys might be thinking why would we put it on beginner why would we not go for like legendary or ultimate because there's no guaranteed win with any of these and if you go on beginner it's a pretty much guaranteed win so i I've actually done the maths on 40 matches per week within squad battles. Now you're going to be getting obviously two at 1,500 on beginner from the featured squad battles and then 38 for roughly around 600 points. That should give you around 25,000 squad battles points in less than one week which will actually qualify you for elite one which is two rare mega packs and like 30,000, 40,000 coins, which in my view is actually ridiculous. So a lot of you guys might be thinking this is going to take forever. Maybe it doesn't work, whatever, whatever, whatever. And admittedly, it does actually take quite a while. But say you wanted to come on and maybe play like 10 games or something like that, that could at least get you some easy packs. So this is literally something to do in your spare time. I wouldn't say go through and do this instead of playing Div Rivals or Foot Champions, but this is literally an easy alternative to getting packs. So what you want to do is to jump on beginner. Now, as you can see right here, this is what my team is actually looking like. It's absolutely dreadful. This no one really decent in here. I've got a load of loans. It's just not that good. And you know what? I'm so confident that I'm going to win this game. I'm going to chuck a bronze in, a uh, cam, and then I'm going to take this icon off and just play another cam there. And then we've got this guy right here. It honestly does not matter. So what you want to do is actually jump into a game. Now, don't be concerned about anything that you actually see right here. As you can see, he's got Ronaldo, Zidane, Kaka. Don't be bothered about that. Honestly, do not be bothered about it because I guarantee that you're going to be winning. Now, what I want you guys to go through and do is score five goals on beginner. Sounds easy enough, right? So all you need to do is literally just get the ball right here. And because you're on beginner, it shouldn't be too hard to actually score yourself five goals. You should be able to do it within the first 10 in-game minutes. As you can see right here, we're just 
just running through, we've got Van Dyke. We've got Van Dyke. Everyone's backing off, and we can just score really, really easily. So you literally just need to score yourself five goals because if you score five goals, you will actually be getting yourself the maximum amount of squad battles points. If you score four goals, it won't be as many as 650 points, which is what you get per game from playing on beginner, which is actually pretty high considering if you were to go and play on like world class, legendary, or ultimate, and you went and lost or you drew, for example, that would be similar to what you're getting. And this is so much less hassle than actually playing against the computer on legendary or ultimate or whatever it may be. You're literally playing on beginner and you're scoring a load of goals and it's really, really easy. And we've not even got to the good part in this video yet. Honestly, it is so, so simple to score all of these goals. I guarantee that this is easy. There's nothing hard about this. As you can see, look at the defenders. They're literally just backing off. You come into the box, you just have a shot and you hit the bar. Which isn't what I was after. I do want to be scoring a goal, definitely. As you can see, though, we have actually scored ourselves our fifth goal. Now, this is where the easy part of getting easy packs comes into it. Watch how easy this will be. I guarantee you that this will be easy. So, what you need to do, as soon as you've scored your fifth goal within sort of, what, the 14th in-game minutes. That's literally took me like a minute. Pass all the way back to your defenders. It doesn't matter who it is. It doesn't matter who you're playing against. It honestly does not matter. And stand still. Yeah, you stand still. And you know what? For the sake of this video, I will literally get this controller right here and put it down. And I will literally fast forward all the way through this game. And when we come back, I guarantee that I won't have been tackled. I guarantee that it'll still be 5-0. And I guarantee that I'm going to be coming out of this with 1,500 squad battles points. Literally for doing nothing. The easiest coins, the easiest packs, the easiest everything that you will ever make in FIFA. So I guess I'll be back in a minute. Looks like it's half time. I mean, we've got through to half time and this is what the stats are looking like. You have seen pretty much everything. I've gone out the room and come back. You've seen everything. This isn't edited, this isn't fake. I guarantee that this is a thing in FIFA 20, which for whatever reason, they've not patched from FIFA 19. I mean, I'm not complaining. It's getting me easy packs, but. And I suppose I'll go through and do the exact same thing as what I was doing before. Sweet. Thank you. 
I mean, I think I've proved my point, to be honest. As you can see, we've gone through for 88 in-game minutes and nothing has happened. Absolutely nothing has happened. You have seen everything. I've been sat on my phone. I've went and done a few bits around the gaff. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. I genuinely don't know what else to say. And for this, literally just sitting here for what, like 10 minutes, I'm going to be getting myself 1,500 squad battles points. And to be honest, I could stop now and just stay on the bronze rewards. And that's still better than nothing. It's still more free packs than what I had before. So as you can see right here, this is what the squad battles points is actually looking like. And are we going to get in that 1,500? Yes, we are. Ah, and we are going to be getting ourselves Silver 3 as well. So like I said, I could literally stop here and still get free packs. What I'll actually do as well, lads, is leave a link in the description to the Footbin website, which will actually show you guys how many points you need for different ranks. So say, for example, you're thinking, you know what, I could try this out for 10 matches. You'll be able to go on there and see how many points you do actually get. But if I stay in Silver 3 right now, I will actually be getting myself one premium gold pack, one gold pack, and 1,500 coins. It's not loads of stuff, but for the sake of like, what, 20 minutes, I've got two free packs and I've got 1,500 coins. I don't know why you wouldn't do this. If you're going to try this out, though, make sure to comment down below. But, lads, I'm actually going to be wrapping this video up here. If you guys enjoyed this video, drop a like on it. Don't forget the giveaway at the start of this video. Subscribe if you're new and comment down below with what videos that you actually want to see in FIFA 20. But this is six. This has been how to get easy packs in FIFA 20. And I am off. Goodbye.